Secretary sources have said that Jammu and Kashmir Lieutenant Governor G.C. Murmu has resigned and that he is now tipped to be the next Comptroller and Auditor General. Let's go across to our reporters, Nazir Masudi joining us from Srinagar and Neeta uh, from Delhi. Nazir, to you uh, first, uh, what are you hearing? Well, uh, we are, what we are hearing is this evening, uh, uh, Mr. Murmu was asked to resign. He has submitted his resignation to Home Ministry. Uh, till evening, nobody has an inkling, not even Raj Bhavan, that such a development is going to happen because through the day he was doing his normal work in the secretary, in the in, in Raj Bhavan and secretary. Uh, there were, you know, multiple meetings which he chaired, and uh, nobody has an inkling that this thing is going to happen. And uh, the day and timing of is very, very significant. It has a symbolic, you know, importance. It has political importance, you know, significance as well. Because today, Jammu and Kashmir's, you know, special constitution, abrogation of Jammu and Kashmir's special constitution position uh, has completed one year. The state was, you know, downgraded as union territory on the same day, on first anniversary, Lieutenant Governor is asked to resign. He submits his resignation is very, very significant. Uh, there are reports that he may be new Comptroller and Auditor General of India. There are reports that um, Raju Maharishi may be appointed as new Lieutenant Governor, but those are all speculations. But what is important that the JNK Lieutenant Governor, yes. G.C. Murbu, was appointed here after Jammu and Kashmir became formally a union territory on 31st October last year. After nine months, he has resigned and we don't know what is happening, yes. happening, and also sources tell us that Prime Minister may be visiting Jammu and Kashmir Srinagar very soon. All right, interesting details there. Uh, Nita, uh, tell us more about Mr. Murmu and what next for him. Also the question, if Murmu is uh, being moved out, who next? Again, as Nazir was mentioning, you know, uh, Mr. Murmu uh, might be swapping places with the current CAG, Mr. Maharishi. Mr. Maharishi would be turning 65 on 8th of August. So that is the, uh, that is the time when he is going to retire. And, you know, uh, uh, sources tell us uh, that there is a communication from Raj Bhavan to Rashtrapati Bhavan. However, Rashtrapati Bhavan is still not confirming whether uh, the Mr. Murmu has sent his resignation or not. But, uh, you know, other sources are telling us that Mr. Murmu is already in Delhi. Uh, he is next in CAG because he has already worked with uh, Pr Prime Minister Narendra Modi when he was Gujarat CM. And he is a close confidant. In fact, when Mr. Modi became the Prime Minister, that time he got... Mr. Murmu to Delhi and posted him as Joint Secretary Expenditure. He became the first Lieutenant Governor of Jammu and Kashmir after the you know state was downgraded from a state to a union territory now within a year you know like in last two uh, years the state the union territory has seen two governors one was mr satyapal malik then mr murmu and now yes. and again a new governor however this time uh, you know there are indications that it might be again a bureaucrat because delhi is more comfortable dealing with a bureaucrat as far as lg is concerned right? All right, Nita Sharma and Nazir Masudi, thanks very much for joining us with those details.